Marines from Marine Corps Air Station Yuma made steady headway today in the recovery of an AV-8B Harrier II aircraft that crashed into a residential neighborhood in Imperial, California, June 4th. With help from community leaders and Marines with Marine Wing Support Squadron 371, parts of the aircraft were excavated and loaded into trucks for transport away from the crash site. Record Chief Sergeant Joshua Jacobs describes some of the stages and challenges of the current operation. Yesterday was basically seeing all the assets that were going to be needed to ensure that this recovery happens safely and quickly. And today's plan is to you know, obviously execute on that and ensure that everything gets lifted, gets removed the way that it is safe to everyone and doesn't cause any more damage to the area that we're in. It's kind of a mess because it's, it, it's a pretty bad crash, so we're having to go through piece by piece to see what we can uh, lift and, and get out bit by bit. Through the use of the, the truck driver who's operating the crane and through me, through hand signals, and uh, obviously selecting a piece, hooking up to it properly, me guiding him through the whole process so that uh, each piece gets safely loaded onto the truck. So far, it's actually going pretty good. Uh, I'm hoping by today or tomorrow we'll be pretty much done with most of all the crane operation. Donning respirators, hard hats, flak jackets, and other protective equipment, the Marines worked carefully to prevent hazardous materials from going airborne. As we're lifting each piece up, because there's a lot of uh, carbon fiber that got burned on the plane, there's a lot of uh, particles that get in the air that are not good for your lungs, so they're having to spray wax, a type of wax and water mixed together so that it helps keep it all intact. It feels good to be able to help out the community. Um, you know, it's sad that a plane crash had happened. It's really good that no one had gotten injured or died. Um, but it does feel really good to help this community out to, to clear up our mess and, and be able to get them back into, you know, a normal lifestyle once again. Reporting from Imperial, California, I'm Lance Corporal Travis Grishanik.